All right, YouTube, I want to go over optimizing the Microsoft Remote Desktop Protocol for everyday use using the local group policy editor. So let's just jump right into it. You want to hit start and type in run. Once you get that new window popped up, you want to type in gpedit.msc, that's all one word, and hit enter. So I'm going to maximize this just so you guys can see it easy, easily and expand this a little bit. So first off, under computer configuration, you want to hit administrative templates, um, windows components, double click that. And once you're under windows components, you want to look for remote desktop services. And once you find that, just double click that. From there, you want to go to remote desktop session host, and then um, the remote session environment. These are all the options you want to pretty much um, configure. You can notice right here, they're all not configured. I like to start off with the folder right here, Remote FX for Windows Server. And these three options are pretty important. You can see they're all not configured. So let's start off with Configure Remote FX. You want to enable this and hit Next Setting. Um, for the optimized visual experience, you want to enable this and you want to set it to medium by default. You can mess around with this. I always set it to high, depending on your bandwidth. And hit Next. And then for the visual experience for remote desktop services session, you want to enable this and you want to set the visual experience to rich multimedia and hit OK. And you'll notice that everything's changed from not configured to enabled. Now, once you've done that, let's go back one option and go through these as well. So the ones that I always um, configure are going to be um, use remote FX graphics for remote app, enable that, hit OK. And then um, prioritize H264 um, graphics mode, enable that, hit OK. Um, configure compression for remote FX data. This is pretty important, all right? So you want to go ahead and enable that and optimize it to use less network bandwidth and hit OK. And then, um, and then configure the image quality. You want to enable this and um, select medium. Depending on your bandwidth, you might want to select low, but I have about a 50 megabyte down, so it shouldn't be too much of a problem for me. If you do select lossless, um, you'll be pulling downwards about 40 to 50 megabytes, so I always recommend never um, selecting lossless. So let's select medium and hit, hit OK. So once you've done these settings, you can go ahead and select close out of this. You want to restart your computer, and then your settings should be perfectly fine. So this Windows right now that I'm running is a remote desktop session. You can see right now that it's pretty responsive. Um, it is pretty responsive. Everything does open up pretty quickly. So let's go ahead and open up Mozilla Firefox right over here. And you saw it was pretty responsive. So that's pretty much all you have to do. Um, you might want to mess around with those settings in the group policy editor to pretty much optimize it for your bandwidth needs. If you do have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section below and I'll be more than happy to answer them.